Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, at the beginning of the year, back in January, with the recent rebranding of Microsoft 365 Office to Microsoft 365 Copilot, it was causing a little bit of confusion. And I posted a video on what's the difference between the two. Now, I'll leave that video linked because it will provide you with a lot more information because this can get very confusing as mentioned. But just to let you know in regards to the Microsoft 365 Copilot, that if you are a Windows user who likes to debloat your machine, that unfortunately Microsoft has announced that it's planning to automatically install a new Microsoft 365 Copilot app on computers of those with Microsoft 365 desktop apps on their PCs. And this is all starting in October 2025, so that's in just a couple of days' time. Now, apparently Microsoft says that the new app is designed to be a so-called centralized hub for Microsoft's AI-powered co-pilot features within the Microsoft 365 ecosystem. And according to Microsoft, it's going to help you with tasks such as finding files related to specific projects, automating repetitive tasks, and accessing other AI-driven capabilities. Now, this is where it gets confusing because, as I've mentioned in that other video, go check it out, Copilot features are already integrated into the various Office apps. But Microsoft says this standalone app is intended to unify the AI experience across all of these apps. So, so AI everywhere, Microsoft, as mentioned numerous times, is intent to get AI into every nook and cranny of its ecosystem. Now, according to Microsoft, it's going to be pushed as an automatic install on computers with the Office apps installed. And at this stage, Microsoft hasn't given us any information whether the app will be uninstallable. I really do hope that Microsoft does give us an uninstall option for the app. And if you are in an enterprise environment, RT admins will have the option to block the automatic installation of the 365 Copilot app through the Microsoft 365 Apps Admin Center. And something else to take note of is that if you find yourself in the EEA, the European Economic Area, you'll be exempt from this automatic installation, thankfully. And obviously that's a direct consequence of the DMA, the Digital Markets Act. So if you haven't got the app yet, I'm sure it's gonna roll out shortly to your device as mentioned, if you have any of those other Office apps installed on your Windows machine. And when it does roll out, if I get knowledge of that, I'll try and keep you guys in the loop. So more bloat coming to the Windows operating system. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.